Yeah. And any names with the, this, this couple? An F. Who? An, an F. F. An F. An F. An F. I don't know. But they're here. Know. They're here. Check they're here. The place. They're here. They own the place. They're kind of allowing us, if you like. To they still on. remain. Their presence is such that it's intense. Completely different feel here. Oh. Huh? <laughs> so it's like, where are we, like, gone underground in this, into some, yeah, no, absolutely, into some, you know, cab, well, almost like a cave. It is, right? isn't it? Definitely, under, definitely underground. What are you seeing? What are you sensing? Why would, why would a child be down here? I have no idea. You tell me. <laughs> playing, playing. Came here to, came here and would play. A little girl, 12, 10, 11, 12, 12, 12, okay. 12 years old. Yeah. Can you see what she's wearing? Is she, is she very clear to you? Is she very strong? She's, it, it seems to be, uh, it seems to be like a summer, a lightweight summer dress. Okay. Yeah. Colour? Sort of Can flaring you see the colour? Blue, like very light, kind of that light baby blue with oh, a stripe yeah. in it. Yeah, right, yeah. Okay. What period is she from? What time period? Thirties? Thirties, maybe? Okay. I mean, the clothes are such that... 1930s, sorry to be... Yeah, 1930s. So we've got a little girl called Katie, and they're dressed in 1920s, 1930s, yeah. with a little summer dress yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. But we need to know what she died of. Or if not what she died of, the connection she has to this place. To the, yes. Was she a guest here? She was connected. She seems to have been connected. Maybe a member of staff where she would have been, she would have often been here anyway and would have loved to have come down here. Right. No. Okay. Well, that makes perfect sense. That just it? feels right, right to me about, you know, okay. everything feels right about that. Okay. Completely different look now. Oh, no, absolutely. Yeah. You know, back to the nice decor. Yeah. Also, also look. remind you of the film as well, doesn't oh, well, it? Well, no, look around. Yeah, these corridors and everything. Yeah. There, isn't it? Now we're going into the Super, infamous. This is an infamous room, and uh, it's okay. infamous for for a few reasons. This is my room. I'm sleeping here. After you. Well, that must be reason enough, is it? Do come in, gentlemen. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> now there's been things happening here and I want to get to the bottom of it. Hang on, people have left this room in a hurry, haven't they? Mm-hmm. You haven't. Not yet. <laughs> yeah, we ha there's a child in the room. Yeah, oh, yeah, over here. Child reaching out, help oh, me. Really? Help me. Long clo clo clothing. What is it? Like a nightwear, like a night, a nightgown. Okay. I don't know what he died of. Only that he is, he passed away, and he was youngster, just a toddler. But he sounds like he's trapped. He's just asking for help, basically. I don't even know. Maybe that obviously he didn't get it at the time. He wouldn't be standing here now with his arms held out. Do you think he's he can, can hear us now when we're talking? I'm sure. Listen. Yeah, listen. If there's a little boy here, hello, sweetie, can you make a noise for me? Can you make a noise? Do we know the boy's name? I cannot be sure of this, but I'm, I'm going to just say Billy, okay? Okay. There's something else, though, isn't there? There's something else. Is there? Well, for a start, my back's freezing cold. Hey, can I just move around a bit mm -hmm. or something? What is it, then? God, there was, there, there was quite a traumatic event. Okay. There's an explosion. Someone lighting gas. Bang. Floor collapsed. Maybe. Collapses. Yeah. A woman involved. A maid. And she went down? 
Yeah. Through the floor. And died or injured? No, 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 injured. Mm -hmm. When was this? Can you see? When, when? Twenties or something. Had to be around now. To the fact that there's gas in use in the yeah. in the building. Mm -hmm. Is she communicating with you, or are you just seeing pictures? Just, just that. Did you hear that then? Now we're getting that over here. Okay. Now. Yeah, yeah. That's different from the floorboards. That sounds like a proper little. Uh... Are people seeing her? I think they are. But I think why this are they woman, seeing I think her? This, she's... I, I think this woman does. I think she, 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 she does. She does move around in this room. I think also she's capable of leaving this room, and walking the corridors. People seeing her in the corridors. You mean? I think they probably have. Well, come um, on. There's another area I want to take you to. Elizabeth. Is that is her it? name? Elizabeth? Elizabeth. There are definitely children here, yeah. Who play up and down here. You can hear even hear little taps boom, boom, of a ball ah, being thrown. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. And I guess because of you know the length of the corridors, and they like to do that to throw, to throw balls and things and run up and down. We would. It'd be know. fantastic. It'd be it? perfect for kids playing. Yeah. yeah. Now something else you see. Something quite different now. So where are we? What? And what's this room here? There's something about this room. Okay. Large figure. Do you want to go in? Man. Mm -hmm. Can we do? Can we yeah, go we in? Can. I mean, are, are yeah. we? Yeah. We've got the keys for all the haunted rooms, or Kieran has, because he's he's sick. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. In you go. <laughs> now this. This is something different. This is something completely different. Large, large figure, large man. Staying in this room, but staying here often. His room. Yeah, his room. This is my room. But is it your room? My room. He wants us out of it. A titled English gentleman. Mm -hmm. uh, very demanding, almost overpowering kind of person. How old? 50, 60 something, maybe. Okay. But very, very strong. Very, very strong impression then of of a man also something else children again whether it's the same children that were were, were out in the passageway there yeah. the corridor but children or a child if people Lord. stayed here would they sense the presence of these particular characters like what sort yeah, of phenomena would they experience i think, I think experience? so i think the like, yeah, yeah, good likelihood of them experiencing it, yeah, a presence. Just, just feeling the presence, yeah. not apparitions or well, trying to get a sense of what, what sort I of things they'd in, experience. Well, I walked in, you know, how can I put this to you? A presence was great, a shape, not that defined, you know, hazy, but if you want to call it, yeah, if we call it an apparition. Now, just before we leave the room, let's get Leslie in, and uh, she can tell us, you know, whether you've hit the nail on the head or whether you're miles away. Okay. What do you think, Leslie, to what Brian said? Might as well start logically with this room, if yeah. I may, by saying this is Lord Dunraven's room, and that you're absolutely right. This is the aristocrat um, that you heard about. This is where Stanley, the man Stanley bought this enormous amount of land from to be able to build it here. Interestingly, um, he was actually Irish, but you wouldn't know to hear him speak, which is quite often the case with aristocracy across uh, Scotland, mm -hmm. Ireland, and England so bang on with that one um, with regard to the room that you've been in earlier with a little boy with Billy that yes the yeah. 217 room that one has very very often been picked up the little boy and in fact people have been petrified is the right word frozen with horror the children running about is extremely common that mm. one again and down in the cellar now I'm interested in that child down in the cellar Katie is a name that we've had before uh, given to us. The colour of her dress we haven't had before that I can find particularly, but the timing's about right. I wonder what she's doing down there. 
And this illness that you describe, you yes. say she has a disease. Tuberculosis was a common disease amongst the young, and there's no question, although this was not a sanatorium, many people came for the fresh air treatment, which was, you know, breathing from oh, the mountains, sure. which is indeed, of course, why it was built in the first place, mm -hmm. Stanley coming here. So I wonder if maybe this child had got tuberculosis. Right. It's okay. a thought. Sure. All right, brilliant. Shall we move on? We will. Thank you. Our primary exploration of the hotel has revealed a number of interesting characters, with Brian picking up on the presence of a maid by the name of Elizabeth, a young boy called Billy, and the ghost of Etho Stanley himself. Will any of these spirits manifest themselves in the coming hours as we switch to night vision? Yeah.